Hello and welcome to our show Dark Army, Weekly Cyber News Top 5. Let's start. Number 5. Computer hack sets off 156 emergency sirens across Dallas. Dallas 156 sirens were triggered at 11.42 p.m. CDT on Friday, April 7. The emergency warning sirens designed to warn citizens of the Texas about dangerous weather conditions such as severe storms and tornadoes were activated around 11.40 p.m. Friday and lasted until 1.20 a.m. Saturday. A city spokeswoman said it received more than 4,400 calls between 11.30 p.m. and 3 a.m. due to people trying to figure out what the sirens were signaling. The emergency system could be compromised by outside radio equipment replicating the tonal code required to trigger the alarms, which in other words is known as a radio replay attack. It is believed that the hacker who managed to trigger alarm last Friday somehow managed to gain access to the siren system documentation to know the exact tonal commands that trigger an alarm and then just played that command signal repeatedly. The Dallas City Council has also voted to pay $100,000 more to its emergency siren system contractor to increase the security of the city's current system. Number 4. Android Trojan targeting over 420 banking apps worldwide found on Google Play Store. A security researcher has discovered a new variant of the infamous Android banking Trojan hiding in apps under different names such as Funny Videos 2017 on Google Play Store. Niels Croes, the security researcher at Securify BV firm, analyzed the Funny Videos app that has 1,000 to 5,000 installs and found that the app acts like any of the regular video applications on Play Store but in the background, it targets victims from banks around the world. This newly discovered banking Trojan works like any other banking malware but two things that makes it different from others are, its capability to target victims and use of DEX protector tool to obfuscate the app's code. Dubbed BankBot, the banking Trojan targets customers of more than 420 banks around the world including Citibanking and some new Dutch banks like ABN Rabobank ASN Regiobank and Bink, among many others. Number 3. Private photos leaked including Miley Cyrus Kate Hudson and Suki Waterhouse and more celebrities are the latest victims of Fapning 2.0. Hackers hacked private photos and published them on Celeb Jihad website. This website published private photos and videos of celebrities. According to a report, Celeb Jihad website claimed that they would leak more photos of celebrities as coming soon. It's gossip website for updated leaked images of celebrities. Number 2. Prison inmates self-built computers from e-waste then connected online using the prison network. Two Ohio prisoners who built personal computers from parts from e-waste, hid them in the ceiling and connected those PCs to the internet via the prison's network. The incident occurred in 2015 but has now been made public by the state of Ohio's Office of the Inspector General which published a 50-page report PDF on Tuesday, following almost a year-long investigation. Once the inmates got online, unsurprisingly they used their skills to break the law. Number 1. U.S. takes down Kelleho's botnet after its Russian operator arrested in Spain. A Russian computer hacker arrested over the weekend in Barcelona was apparently detained for his role in a massive computer botnet and not for last year's U.S. presidential election hack as reported by the Russian media. Peter Yuryevich Levishev, 32 years old Russian computer programmer suspected of operating the Kelihos botnet a global network of over 100,000 infected computers that was used to deliver spam steal login passwords and infect computers with ransomware and other types of malware since approximately 2010, the U.S. Justice Department announced Monday. The arrest was made possible after the FBI learned just last month that Levishev was traveling with his family to Spain from his home in Russia a country without any extradition treaty to the United States. Thanks for watching. Subscribe and be a part of our community. Hello and